I'm so scared. I just don't know what he'll do. Of course. Well, well. If it isn't our new arrival. Heard you done in those preacher brothers. You've made a lot of enemies in no time at all, so I'll only say this once. Us hunters don't like competition. Stay out of our business, kiddo. We've got the monster hunt at Gideon's Rock covered. If you intrude on our turf, you're on your own. My guys are a ragtag bunch of fighters from all around Jericho. I'm the one running this whole shit show. Got a contract to hunt down some crazy abomination at Gideon's Rock. And we'll finish it, no questions asked. If I were you, I wouldn't cross a single hunter out there, and that includes myself. Just FYI. Like you haven't heard about it. Everyone's talking about the damn creature. Some sort of nanite mutant is loose in Jericho. It's laid waste to a prison and killed a load of people downtown. Now it's retreated to Gideon's Rock. Bad move, if you ask me. <laughs> and some old suits put a bounty on the thing's brain. And we'll claim it. Nobody's gonna get in our way. Not the children of the Spark. Not the AID. And definitely not you. I'll be keeping an eye on you. Listen carefully, my disciples. An interloper has wormed his way in our holy order. He killed my brother, and now he's out to get me. Seek out the heathen and bring him to justice. Our holy mission is at stake. Do not worry. This is not the end. Are you insane? Brother Eli will have your head on a platter for breaking into his chapel. You did what? You have no idea what havoc you've unleashed. I'll lay low until this blows over. You should do the same. There's a whole network of decommissioned tunnels just below the city. Nobody will find you there. Smell? Uh, hi, I'm Mr. Scrappy, your all-in-one rumor monger, information resource, and audio file vendor. I'll scan every audio recording you have and reward you accordingly. So, I'm not surprised you agreed. After all, I've studied your profile. 
All you need to do is bring me your audio recordings every once in a while for review. Since I'm in a generous mood, I'll compensate you with a couple of exclusive lost recordings. Here, the first ones on the house. I haven't seen Brother Eli in a while. I hope nothing's happened to him. Soon I will bring about a new age of harmony between man and machine. A new era. A new dawn. Such a shame about dear Jonathan. But sometimes She's totally one drunk just on has power. to be pragmatic. Get your high horse. No George matter how trying... much. Hey there, killer. Heard you took care of that fat fuck Johnny and his sniveling little brother. Good job. Those creeps had it coming for a long time. Maybe you should do a hat trick <laughs> and go for their mother next. Can't stand that old bitch. What's up with Jordan? She's totally uh -huh. drunk on power. Get off your high horse. Jordan's just trying to keep the band together. Large group of hunters sighted. Potentially hostile. Copy that. I've spotted them near the scanner gate. Over and out.
Hey, partner, remember me? We met downstairs outside the clink. You are the talk of the town these days. Maybe we should work together. If you're interested, find me under the bridge of the canal. I'll be waiting. Cerberus? You're just as tough, and that's a real compliment. And I see you got yourself some new gear. Not one of my favorite sets, but still impressive. Well, I don't know what exactly you did out there, but you pissed off more people than even a PAX robot could. If you're that good at finding new gear, there might be a way for the two of us to work together. You'd never believe it. It was my first day on the job at Creo Industries when a crazy power surge went through the system. I spent days fighting my brain-fried co-workers until I finally escaped the compound. And for what? I reached Jericho City just as they sealed it off by building that goddamn wall. Bad luck. Twice. I've been in a lot of trouble ever since. The perfect scapegoat. This time I'll get out, that's for sure. But first, I'll uncover their dirty secrets. We gotta get out of this godforsaken place. This whole quarantine thing stinks to high heaven. The only way to escape Jericho City is by uncovering the truth. But AID already knows what I'm after. They'll spot me if I get too close, so I need to stay underground. I need a disguise. A set of AID armor would allow me to sneak past them. Maybe reach their command center. I'll try and get to their computers, find out what happened to the kids they took. If they found a cure for defrag, why don't they disclose it? I'll tell you why. Because you can't heal people with bullshit. Mark my words, the truth will come out. Great. These guys are more machine than man and they show no mercy. So why should we? Target the gear parts we're looking for and slice them off. Then go to a crafting station and voila, a brand new set of armor. Oh, and don't forget to bring it back to me. Great. Just pass me the missing gear pieces.
Warren, Warren, Warren. Why won't you cooperate? Am I not? Am I really supposed to believe any of that BS? Believe what you want, prick. Oh, but I do, Warren. I really do. For example, right now, I believe that you'll be in terrible pain once I press this button under my desk. You bastard. I'll get you back for this. <laughs> Threatening an officer of the law, are you? You've been keeping a lot of secrets since that Creo incident. Yeah, whatever. You got nothing on me and you know it. AID has messed with the wrong guy this time. Force authorized.
Welcome to best clinic this side of Seaside Court, Tavarish. Feeling a bit sickly? I've been able to keep them at bay, but I'm not quite, how do you say, enough ripped to beat them without my little turret over there. Normally, I give you real thorough checkup for free, but we run out of medical equipment. How pathetic, da? I am world-renowned surgeon, yet my hands are tied. Damn apparatchiks confiscate nanomachines all over Jericho to cover up truth about nano-disease, defrag. Without alternate supply routes, I'd be screwed. Just a moment ago, they shot down secret delivery drone right outside office. Even if soldiers don't find it in time, those damn scavengers will. You'll have to be sneaky. But if you pull off, little heist, I'll let you use med station on wall for free. Of course, Tovarish. Your health is my business, eh? Say, ah, uh, huh. Your nanite readings are strange, very disturbing. Uh, but nothing to worry about. Probably. You're stronger than entire Russian weightlifting team. You can pass through that scanner gate, no worries. Of course I'm real. Just trust evidence of your eyes. They call me Dr. Molotov. Don't believe government agate prop. I am hard-working, genuine medical person. Dasvidaniya, Tavarish.
Contamination detected.
She's heading toward the subway tunnels. We'll never find that damn kid if she gets underground. Doesn't matter. The general's got her ID. She's going to Gideon's Rock. The Mercs of the Babylon Gardens can take over. Babylon Gardens, copy that. <laughs> Hunters have arrived at the Cloud Nine Bar. No incidents to report. Over. Copy that. They found a way around the scanner gate. Looking into it now. Over and out. Looking for the party? Go right ahead. Normally I'd have to frisk you, but what's the point anymore? People up there are too numb to worry at this point. They want to forget whatever's going on down here. You'll meet a lot of kooks up there asking you for favors. A bunch of needy pansies.
following me around? I told you already, the monster belongs to me. Taking care of business, what's it look like? Me and my guys are just about to kill the beast swiftly and mercilessly. So don't even try to mess with us. All hell's breaking loose at Gideon's Rock. You don't cut me out yet. This battle's far from over. Name's Black. Jordan Black. A.K.A. The Huntress. Mess with me and it'll be the last name you ever hear. A good general always has to look at the big picture, kiddo. Can't do that when you're right in the middle of the action. I'm having a hard enough time coordinating my troops as it is. Looks like my hunters have lost the plot. Once we're done with this job, I'm gonna kick their asses from here to the bloody moon, but right now I've got bigger fish to fry. I told you before, the monster belongs to me. But... If you go out there anyway... You're welcome to kick the other hunters' asses. Tell him Jordan sent you. I'll be keeping an eye on you. Yo, what are you doing just walking into my inner sanctum? I don't even know if I can trust you. Tell me the password or get lost. Not funny. The fate of the world is at stake. Look for a scrappy ally at Seaside Court. After that, we'll talk. Yo, what are you doing? Just walk... Tell me. No, that's not... Well, you've earned my respect through rather... unconventional means. That's what I call initiative. Our numbers are still low. There needs to be a groundswell. We have to send a signal. Tell people to mobilize. But we're not going to do it over the airwaves. Can't trust bot and tech. Not anymore. In that case, welcome to the resistance. I see you already have a graffiti drone. Sweet! That should make things easier. Now all you gotta do is leave the new resistance symbol all around Jericho. We're a group of top secret underground freedom fighters. So shush. Everything going on around us started with a power surge at Creo. After that, those damn nanites were unleashed. But there's more to it. Much more. The government is trying to cover something up. Something big. We have to fight the system with everything we've got. Jericho City was built on a hell mouth. I organized this raid myself. Needed a place to hide in plain sight. We even have an open bar. Just tell the bartender DJ Tala sent you. <laughs> yeah, right. One. That's what they all say. This is top secret stuff, champ. So zip it. All we need is a straight and simple paint job. Our founder, Dr. Chavez, 
chose the resistance symbol. It's this branch thingy with leaves. Seems to hold special meaning for her. Just use your drone's spray can module to leave our symbol wherever you go to spread our message. Come back and report to me regularly. The revolution will prosper. Party on! Ah, a new face. Haven't seen one of those in a while. We have some quite intriguing guests at this party. Too rich to worry, too poor to leave. Not me, though. I'll be long gone when the proverbial shit hits the fan. A man of my caliber requires the most exquisite piece of armor available. Sadly, my previous supplier was brought down by his lofty ambitions and the tip of a hunter's blade. Guess nobody else has the guts to go out there and do what needs to be done. Okay, but it's not gonna be easy. Um, I should have told you before asking for help, shouldn't I? Don't worry, you'll do just fine. You know those gorgeous robot statues they have at Gideon's Rock? Their armor is simply impeccable. 24 carats of pure protection. Of course, you'd have to strip them for every single part. Mint condition. I think that goes without saying. Is it getting breezy? In Come back if you find more parts. That stuff's worth its weight in gold. Following me around. I took Taking care of business. Me and my guys are just about to kill the beast swiftly and most so don't even all hell's breaking loose at Gideon's Rock. But don't cut me out yet. This battle's far from over. A good general always has to look at the big picture, kiddo. Can't do that when you're right in the middle of the action. I'm having a hard enough time coordinating my troops as it is. My hunters have lost the plot. So I've done this job, I'm gonna kick the asses from here to the bloody moon, but right now I've got bigger fish to fry. I told you before, them, but if you go out there anyway, you're welcome to kick the other hunters' asses. Tell them Jordan sent you. I'll be keeping an eye on you.
should have taken the job at Seaside Court instead. This party's a total bust. Excuse me. I have an important message for... Oh no. Not again. Security failure. System cleanup initiated. Thank <laughs> you. 